Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to one more video. Uh, today's video is going to be another vendor reset for November the 2nd. Um, we're going to look into some uh, weapons, gears, and mods that I'm going to recommend for you to grab for this week vendor reset. So let's get into this. Alright, guys, so if you start on the special equipment vendor in the base of operation, he is going to be selling this awesome LVOC. Um, this LVOC has a 22% enemy armor damage and the talents are vicious, destructive and intense. Um, this is a great gun actually for a nomad build because you already have vicious and destructive. You can switch uh, intense for something else like uh, ferocious or um, unforgiven and you have a good uh, weapon for PvE for... Uh, a nomad build and I'm saying nomad build because it has vicious and you're gonna most of the time have more than two segments of health with a nomad build so the vicious gonna give you 10% uh, critical hit chance which is huge on a um, um, AR so this is a great gun uh, grab it and base of operation special equipment vendor still in the base of operation if you come to the Darzon gear vendor inside the base of operation um, he's gonna be selling this MP5 ST. Uh, this is a great, great uh, SMG for PVE. It has brutal, ferocious, and destructive. As it is, these talents are huge, are the best talents you can get for max damage against NPCs. Um, brutal is great because NPCs, uh, headshot damage is great against NPCs, ferocious, and destructive. So, I highly recommend if you don't have a SMG for your PV builds, this is a great buy. Um, and still in this uh, Darzon Gear vendor, if you need some stamina mods with health, he he's selling some prototype stamina mods. It has 252 um, stamina with 2970 health. It's not the best, it's not the max, but it's pretty close to it. And if you need some, this is going to be great. I myself am going to get this MP5 ST right now. Darzone 5th F. If you come to the Darzone vendor on the Darzone 5th F, he's going to be selling this LVOC. It has uh, Compton, Ferocious, and the Termed. Um, as you see right now, I'm actually wearing my pv best pv build with a striker and you see that the derm is not gonna be it's not gonna be unlocked because it requires a lot of skill uh, el uh electronics so what i would do take out the dead terms and put something else like destructive and you have a good uh damage pv weapon for your build so uh, that's why i'm recommending this gun is a lvoc darzon vendor on the fifth f if you make a stop in Dante's Run safe house, the gear vendor in here is going to be selling some prototype performance mods. It has 4.5 ballistic shield uh, damage resilience. 4.5% uh, 4, 4, 4 is almost max. I think max is 5%. And these are my recommendations for any ballistic shield uh, builds because these do a lot of... Um, good for your de defense build so i highly recommend if you need some if you have a defense build this is the most that you want to go asap next we're gonna go to medicine stand in here this gear vendor he's gonna be selling some a prototype stamina mods with three percent damage to elite and 2.5 uh stamina um, last week, I don't know if you missed, but there was uh, some stamina mods with 4% damage to lead, which is the max. Uh, if you guys missed it, it's going to be a while for us to have it back because those mods are really rare to find. So for now, if you need some stamina mods with damage to lead, this is the one to get for this week. These are the only ones for this week. These are on the medicine stand. And actually in the same vendor... There is some prototype performance mod in here with 3.5 tor damage. They are not max, max is 4%, but that's pretty good. Uh, 3.5 for your fire turret. If you make any type of build with fire turret, uh, this is all great. 
and my last stop is gonna be on the dark zone 5 on the safe house inside dark zone 5 he's gonna be selling some good mods for your guns the first one and the buy of the week the one that I recommend for you to get this week the most is gonna be this Omega rifle suppressor it has 17.5 headshot damage, 4% critical hit damage, and 3% critical hit chance. These are the mods that I use in all my uh, PvE builds. These are the ones I highly recommend for your uh, legendary PvE builds, just like the ones that I have on my channel. If you see my legendary runs, these are the mods that I use. So these are the recommendation because they do a lot of damage against NPCs. There's a couple stuff in here that you can grab too. This small grip has 19% critical hit damage, 4.5 optimal range, and 2.5 stability. This is not too bad. It's a great uh, grip. And uh, this one is in the same safe house as the one that have the Omega Rifle Suppressor. The third one is going to be this high velocity magazine. This is for some builds, not for every build, but this some builds can take... Um, advantage of this it has seven percent critical hit chance 11.5 magazine size and 5.3 rate of fire some type of builds you might use this i've used this a lot of times on my sniper rifles depending on what type of build that i use so if you need some of these they are here too well that's it for me for this week guys i hope you guys enjoy um i'm gonna start I'm gonna start to doing this weekly, the vendor is said, especially because my channel has a lot of PvE nowadays, uh, for the PvP it's kinda low. Um, if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs, uh, thumbs up. If you wanna catch me streaming every day, I'm on twitch.tv for slash megan17. And uh, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe and uh, I have plenty of guides to help you out with some stuff. So I right, see you guys in the next one, be safe.